Hello everybody, so today I will talk about differential equation. The topic today is about how to calculate about this one. So now I will show you the technique. First, we need to find about complementary solution. And the second one. That should be about particular solution. So I will go to this one about complementary solution. We will go about second derivative minus three first derivative minus four y equal to number zero. So in this situation, we put about y equal to e to the power of lambda t. So that's the first step in here. Uh, that should be about s, not about t. So if we do first derivative, you got about e to the power of lambda s with lambda in here second derivative you got about lambda square e to the power of lambda s so now we put everything in here to this one so you got about lambda square e to the power of lambda s minus number three lambda e to the power of lambda s and minus 4 e to the power of lambda s so we put this one in factorization so we find the solution of this one and you will got about number 4 and negative number 1 so in this situation you got about C1 and we got about E to the power of negative S that's about from negative number 1 C2 that's about the constant e to the power of 4 s now let's go to particular solution in this situation we put about y e s that should be about a1 plus a2 and we have s and a3 that should be about s square so if we do first derivative you got about a2 to a3 s and if we do second derivative you will got about to a3 so we put everything in here compare for this one in here so we got about 2a3 minus number 3 and we got about a2 plus 2a3 s minus number 4 multiply with this one a1 a2 s and we have a3 s square equal to 3 s square plus true in here so we arrange based on the power of s about s square we just got about a3 
about s we got about negative 6 a3 and we have negative number 4 a2 and the last one you got about 2a3 minus 3a2 and negative number 4a1 equal to 3s square plus 2 so according to coefficient a3 is about number 3 oh this should be negative number 4 because we have this one negative number 4 a3 equal to number 3 in here the next one we don't have s in here negative 6 a3 minus 4 a2 equal to number 0 in here and the last one this is about this one so you got about 2 a3 minus 3 a2 minus 4 a1 equal to number 2 so we saw this equation in here and you got about a1 a2 a3 A1 that should be about negative number 3 over 4 A2 that should be about 9 over 8 And A3 should be about negative 55 over 32 So now we got about this one negative 3 over 4 plus 9 over 8 s negative 55 over 32 s square so we combine this one and this one we got the final answer Uh, I need to edit about this one. That should be this one in here. So, this one, that should be in here. That's the end. Thank you for watching.